On your right, Tara. Let me see the floor right here, Tara. Tara, on the left side, Tara, left side. Nice, yeah. Let me see the floor. Hey friends, it's Red Carpet Roxy, and tonight I'm at the American Influencer Awards. I'm going to take you inside for all the action so you don't want to miss it. So what do you think makes a good influencer? I think what makes a good influencer is to be vulnerable, to show your true colors. You don't want someone who's cookie cutter. We're all different, and we should celebrate our differences. And that's what's unique about so many creators here is that we're all different. Who is influencing you right now on social media? I love uh, I love influencers who are multi-talented and who sing. I'm all about the makeup artists too. I love Desi Perkins. A lot of them, you know, there's so many to choose from. Life opens up when you do, so just show it all. Show yourself and have fun. What are some of your best skincare tips? Wash your face at night. Mm -hmm. Don't go to bed with your face dirty. Mm -hmm. um, wear sunscreen mm -hmm. and hydrate. Yeah. So, important. so important. Okay, let's say you don't hydrate the night before you have a wild night. How do you fix your skin the next day? Okay, see, I'm the t I'm tough to ask because I will get home at four o'clock and I may have had too much to drink and I still do my full routine. Like it is I like love it. it's ingrained in me, no matter the state of my brain, that that has to be done before I go to bed. Must be done. It's like must be done. Yeah. What do you do the next day to repair your skin after a crazy wild night like? Oh my gosh, I always make sure what happens the night before is that I clean my face, take off all my makeup and everything. You're religious about it. You're very good. Religious. You don't sleep with your makeup on? No, never. never. It's a no, no. What beauty product are you most obsessed with right now? Oh my gosh, right now? I will say I did just get the Dior Youth Capture Plump Filler Serum. Is it legit? Pretty amazing. So favorites videos used to be super popular. Like everybody would do a favorites video and you would do it every month and then you do like a big one at the end of the year, like your favorite things. So what is the best beauty tip that you can give all the ladies at home? Something they might not know. Easy beauty tip. Okay. I have been doing this for over a decade. It is called Alba on Petroleum. Okay. It's, you don't want to put petroleum on your skin because it's very bad for it. Hmm. It's like a Vaseline. So at night, I will put this or chapstick, not regular chapstick, organic, like an organic lip balm. I put it around my eyes at night and just let my skin just soggy and soak that up so I don't have any wrinkles. So it doesn't break out at all or anything. It's lovely to meet you. Obsessed. Thank you. These. Look, I have, I have these. Yeah, I have bees. Because it's all about the, the little bugs. You know? Yeah, I like the little bugs. Thank you. Thank you so much. Well, I love this. No doubt. One of your creations. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. The, I made this for Cher. So, um, yeah, I did. I made this cape for Cher. And she wore it. And then you know who else wore it? Uh, Billy Porter wore it for um, an Emmys week. So, I, you know, I'm like, let me, I want to wear it too. I don't want to <laughs> let it go. An honor. It's very pretty and very cute. And these last few years have been amazing. What's been the highlight for you? Um, I think our, I think our continued success working with um, Jennifer Lopez has definitely been the, the highlight for me. We have over 56 placements on Jennifer Lopez, and that's that's a lot. That's more than some of the really huge <laughs> fashion houses. She reaches out when she wants me for something, and that makes me really happy. It seems like things are going great. Are we talking like wedding bells anytime soon? It's so funny because in The Bachelor, I feel like it's so right. expedited, and people are like, "When are you getting married?" Yeah. I'm like, "It's been six months." So no, we're not getting married anytime okay. soon, but we are just enjoying our relationship. So there's no final rose yet? No, 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 <laughs> definitely not. So let's talk a little bit about the wedding. Are you obviously getting excited? Five months away, are you ready? No. I mean, am I ready to be yes. Mrs. <laughs> Emmett? Yes. yes. But are we, no, we have a lot to do. What's been the best part of the planning process for you? Honestly, and this is so cheesy, the best part of the planning process was going down to Newport Beach and we started, you know, tasting our cake and it got very real that like this is this is my dude. Like I'm just so in love. Aww, yeah. That's really sweet. <laughs> and so are you guys thinking about kids? Like is that even a thought? No kidding. Oh girl, it's always a thought okay, for me. So you really want some. I really want some. I like I adore his kids so much. I feel like they're just a part of me. He he reminds me of how my dad was with me with his girls. Hey everyone, it's Patrick Starr. Hi, I'm Candy Johnson. Hey guys, it's Michael Costello. Hi, this is Becca Tilly. Hey guys, it's Lala Kent with Vanderpump Rules, and I am with Red Carpet Roxy. 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 You're welcome. <laughs>